I'm gonna see me grow in 2020 because your girl finna get in the game. No more sitting on the bench. Put me in, coach. Like, and that's on that. Like. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's your girl Jay Shantae, and in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to make a digital vision board. Also, today is New Year's Eve, and I will be posting this video today so you guys can have your 2020 vision boards prepared for 2020. Well, happy New Year's Eve, everyone. We all made it. If you want to be here, we made it. Hey. Nah, I'm just playing. But, so if you guys don't know, a vision board is basically a board or background. You put all your dreams, aspirations, everything you want to accomplish for the following year. And basically you manifest it or you pray on it. Just make sure it happens. So in this video, I'll basically, like I said before, I'll be showing you guys how to make a digital one. Because normally when people use a board or a paper, it gets messed up, you lose it. Something happens to it. So I'm going to make sure I show you guys how to make one on your phone so it won't get destroyed so make sure you stay tuned if this is your first time watching make sure you like comment subscribe and join the fam and then if it's not if you're a returning member family gang 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 if you're returning still like and comment and let's get into this video so the first thing that you want to do to make sure you have a vision board that is very precise and accurate and everything that you want, first thing you want to do is write down all your goals for 2020. Focus on just 2020, it'll help you more and benefit you more, I feel like. I'll put up my, some of my goals on the screen. I'm not going to put down all of them. I'm going to put down some of my goals on the screen so you guys know. For instance, one of my goals for 2020 is to get a thousand, get not a thousand, excuse me, get a hundred thousand subscribers on YouTube and you become monetized. So by watching this video now, you can help contribute to that. I'm just kidding. But yes, my, one of my goals is um, to get a hundred thousand subscribers on YouTube and I will be posting more consistently and I've been slacking, but I'm ready. Like 2020, I'm only going to mm. All right. And then another goal that I have in mind is to also get an apartment, a puppy, and a puppy. I, as you guys know, I am graduating from the illustrious Bethune Cookie University in May 2020. And I, my goal is not to come back home. Like, I just don't want to come back home. There's nothing wrong with being home. I just don't feel productive and tend on them. Like, I like living on my own and doing what I have to do for myself. So, the second thing that you want to do is find images that align with your goals. So for what I did, like, I'm gonna show you guys my vision board. But what I did was, I wanna work out and have my body snatched for 2020. So what I did, I found a picture of Megan Thee Stallion. Yes, it was Megan Thee Stallion. And I cropped her head out and put my head in. So if you see yourself in that thing, is you're, you're, more, you're more likely to go get that goal. Like, if I see myself in a Benz, Oh, that's going to be me in, in next year. Like, I'm going to have me a Benz. I don't want a Benz because I love the car that I have. But I don't, I'm not a really materialistic person like that. So, yeah. Anyways. So, um, put yourself in the in the actual um, image. So, it was this lady. Excuse me. This lady, Erin On Demand. I seen, I watched her video. And she did say, when you put yourself in that goal, it helps manifest the goal better. Even better. Excuse me. So basically what I did, I did that in a couple pictures. So it was like one of the pictures, me and my boyfriend, I cropped our heads into this couple on a vacation. Boom, we're taking vacations in 2020. I, um, I cropped out $10,000. So one of my main goals is to say $10,000 by May. It's going to happen. I, that's one thing you have to speak into fruition. Like I'm not saying I want to do this. I will do this. I'm going to do this. This will happen. You gotta speak it into existence so it can happen. All right, number three, number three. Number three, make sure you find quotes and everything else that align, what is that? Oh, that's a, I'm about to say, what is that behind me? All right, make sure you find quotes, themes, anything that align with your goals. So you can have everything in there, like, y'all, like everything about you. One of the main quotes that I use on mine was, it says, 
There are people less qualified than you doing the same, doing the things that you want to do simply because they decide to believe in themselves. Period. People do what, like, you can do anything you put your mind to, but people who are less qualified than you are doing it because they're not scared. They don't care. Like, they're just jumping out. Like, everything don't have to be prepared in a line for you to do it. Just do it. And that's for me, too, because I always want to have everything perfect, everything in line. Like, girl, just do it. Like, What's the worst mistake? Somebody saying no, you not you failing? Like use that as a stepping stone and a learning opportunity. Like y'all, that's gonna see me grow in 2020. Your girl finna get in the game. No more sitting on the bench. Put me in, coach. Like and that's on that. Like I'm not. I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all gonna hate me 2020. Oh, y'all gonna love me because 2020. I'm on your like I am on your like. But anyways. I'm also going to do a screen recording on how to make it. And I'm going to give y'all a time slot too because I like to talk. So basically y'all, I already made my vision board. But I'm going to make another one with you guys. So if you want to see after this, make sure you stay tuned so you can see how to actually do it. The apps that you are going to need is Fontono, Eraser. And I use Pinterest. You can use Google. Um, Pinterest or Google. And that's about it, y'all. It's so easy. It took me literally like 30 minutes. Not even, I'm good with this stuff. So it literally took me like 15 minutes. But y'all, but for real, for real, y'all, like 2020 is our year. We got it. Like, I'm not the type of person to do New Year's resolution every year. Like, I never do that because I'm just like, if I know I'm not going to do something, I'm not going to say I'm going to do it. But this year, I feel it. Like, I feel it, y'all. Like, I don't know. I'm going to get my 100,000 subscribers. I'm going to get, I'm going to save $10,000 by May. I'm going to get me an apartment. I'm going to get me a puppy. I'm going to meet J. Cole. Y'all can see, oh, y'all can see J. Cole in my vision board. I put scriptures because I'm trying to grow my relationship with God. Like, y'all, without God, a lot of things would never happen this year. It's been a tough year, but guess who made it through? This guy. And then that's like, I'm going to work my butt off and we're going to get it. So, hot girl semester, hot girl 2020. Let's get it. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the internet and type in aesthetically pleasing backgrounds just to find the background you want for your um, vision board. Find the picture that you would like, be sure to save it so you can go to your gallery. So this next step is completely optional. The only reason why I'm going into my photos because I wanted to make my picture horizontal and not vertical. It's completely optional, you can do whichever way you want. But I went into my settings and my photos and I rotated it so it can be horizontal. The next thing you would like to do is um, find a picture that aligns with one of your goals. So one of my goals was to get 100,000 subscribers for YouTube and I just went into Google and looked up subscribers and I took the picture and I saved it to my gallery. After you save it to your gallery, you want to go to the eraser app and make sure that you upload it. And what I click, I click targeted area and then clicked around it and I saved it and it should come out just like that. After that, you would want to go into Pinterest or Google and look up one of your other goals. So one of my goals, like I said, it was um, potentially grad school. So I just screenshot any picture that said grad school and went into the eraser app. And then I erased everything alongside that didn't have grad school in it. So like the 30 days, the application challenge, I just edited everything so it can have grad school in it. And then all you have to do is save that and it'll go into your pictures as a PNG and which means a transparent background. The next thing I did was I want I want an apartment, so I looked I went into um, Pinterest and I repeated the same thing over, screenshot it and excuse me I screenshot it and I put it through eraser and erased everything that I do not need because you don't need all of that stuff on your um, on your vision board. thing I did was find a picture of J. Cole on Pinterest and I saved it and then I went back to the eraser app and erased everything that I didn't need. Sometimes you can use target area to um, delete the background but it was kind of hard for me I guess because everything looks so dark but then I just erased alongside of him. I zoomed in 
and then I erased all the edges that it didn't fit. This is not my cleanest um, looks that I've done. I was just rushing and for the sake of the video. Um, I'm not gonna keep repeating what I did. I'm just gonna let you guys watch and hope you guys enjoy this video. After you find all the pictures that you desire to go on your vision board, you're gonna go into photo and then you're gonna go, um, make sure you put the background that we first found as first so you can put everything else on top of it. Everything is gonna look transparent because we did put it through eraser and they have a transparent background. To add text to your vision board, you're going to randomly click on anywhere on the screen and then the text should pop up. To create a design with your words, first you probably want to enlarge it and then you'll click on style and click the color that you desire for your letters to be. So I, I click black and for stroke is basically just the outline color of your words. Um, you can go to style so it can have a shadow of any color you like. So, and mine has, a, my, I put mine as a pink shadow actually. To creating the perfect vision board is to make sure you save it because you don't want all your hard work going to waste so thank you guys for watching my channel i love you guys and make sure you subscribe so the last step that you guys want to make sure that you do is make sure you pray on your goals and manifest them so when you pray on it faith without works is dead so when you pray on it you got to make sure you put in the work to do everything you to make sure you get everything that you desire so thanks for watching my channel make sure you like comment and subscribe and share it with a friend. Hope you guys have a great New Year's and have a great day. Love you guys.